Hey guys, it's Madame Wario. Welcome back to my stream, for part two for the day. Um, welcome to the LEGO Super Mario Adventures unboxing. Thank you guys so much for being here tonight and for all your support. This is uh, was something that I thought was going to happen at the beginning of August and now it's the very last day of August and here we are because shipping delays, I guess. I don't really know. Um, I pre-ordered LEGO Super Mario Adventures uh, back in... I think back in February, like it was when it was first announced and it was supposed to ship on the first and it didn't, I didn't get it until the 17th or 18th of this month. So um, it was much later than expected and then I had a bunch of other things scheduled so it didn't get, didn't get put out um, as early as I would have liked. Lego takes a very long time to put together. I'm by no means putting everything together tonight. I'm really just unboxing, showing off the pieces, how they work when they touch each other. Um, and showing off what I got, which is the starter kit plus one of the Mario suits. So this is going to be a rather short stream, so, um, you know, don't expect anything super long. I just want this to be kind of short and sweet to the point, but have like a fun unboxing, live unboxing with you guys instead of doing video and all that stuff because I, I really wanted this to be a stream. Thank you guys so much for the hosts and everything, and let's go ahead and start by replaying this guy. Thank you so much, Stardub94, for the resub. Thank you so much for eight months of hype. Really appreciate it. Welcome back to the Bach family. And big boss. Thank you so much, and thank you for all the hosts, everybody, as well. I give you all the boss, Stardub. Thank you so much for that. Armand 2017, Matt Marmalade, Ideal T. I keep wanting to say Teal. It's because your name is like looking, it looks teal in my chat, and it just seems like, oh, that's what it is. Just ignore it. You're Ideal T, I know. Marching Band, thank you so much for the sub hype as well. Thank you so much. Welcome back to the Ba family. Oh, thank you so much, Marching Band. That's so sweet. Psycho Nako Man, by the way. I love that Siri didn't even say that name right. Uh, that's really funny. But thank you so much for the sub hype. I give you all the boss. 
But back to you all that are here. Uh, thank you for being here. Armand 2017, Water Pixels, uh, Rainbow Road 1996, Mr. Wario, Scottman 895, Yo Yo Yoshi 95, The So So Ship 9, Rolly 64, Marching Band, of course, Jeremy is the Boss 12, Shy Guy for Days. Water pixels, I got you. I think I got everybody. Whoa, Big Bree is in the house, though. Big Bree, what's up? Welcome. Um, are you loving that bag? Yeah. It's really exciting. Oh my gosh. So, I had to go out and get... Uh, I was out of a lot of, like, essential craft materials. Like, I was almost out of stuffing. I was out of almost... Or almost out of hot glue. Like, things that I use constantly. And so I went to the craft store earlier and the plastic bag that my stuff was in kitty has claimed for her own and is like this is the greatest thing ever she also inflated my uh my like fiber fill bag you know how things can be vacuum sealed and they stay really flat no i that's how that's how this was and she bit into it and clawed it and it inflated so now it's huge you did she doesn't care i'm sorry um <laughs> so anyway Fun fact. Um, I did not happen to get broccoli and cheddar soup. I, when I was out, I was actually really close to Papa John's, so I ended up picking up a pizza instead. And I was like, you know what, because it was on my way home, I was like, okay, I'm just going to get pizza. I was totally going to get broccoli cheddar soup, but then I was like, okay, I guess I'm just going to, you know, fall to my, what is that, your Achilles heel? Um, is that the right slang? I don't know. I know slang, but I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Um, but yeah, you can't go wrong with pizza. I I will definitely get some broccoli cheddar soup t sometime this week, though, for sure. So no, I was going to, and I even thought about it, and I was like, I'll just I'll I'll get it some other time this week because I was like, okay, I'm really hungry. I'm on my way home. So um, I had I had spaghetti and meat balls they were vegan um which is so, it's funny because whenever i get like vegan meat stuff the more it tastes like meat like the more i just cannot eat it like i just don't like that taste like and so i i've been into one and it was like okay and then i was like yeah i can't eat another one of these <laughs> It's like impossible burgers. I love that they make them for people who love the taste of meat, but I'm not that person, so I tried an impossible burger and kind of gagged, and I was like, okay, I can't do this. I need like a veggie burger that does not taste like impossible. So anyway, but that's what I had over the weekend because that's what my sister wanted for her birthday. And so I was like, I had the pasta, I gotta get the pizza. So I love to have, um, I love getting Panera when it starts to get cold out. That's like one of my favorite early fall meals. So good. Can you guys hear this music at all? Not all of these are the same level, so it's like some are really quiet and others are like not quiet at all. So I'll turn it up a little bit and see if it gets too loud here. Um, but yeah. Oh, you had a vegan burger one time made of sweet potatoes. Oh, so good. They really are good, though. Like, I mean, even when I first started, when I first became a vegetarian, which, you guys, this October will be my 20-year anniversary of becoming a vegetarian. Isn't that crazy? Um, even when I, like, first stopped eating meat and started, like, transitioning to being a vegetarian, which really took, you know, it was, like, probably a solid two years before I was, like, fully a, a pescatarian, or I'm really a pescatarian, but before I really went, like, vegetarian because when you're 10 years old you kind of have to eat what your parents give you and I started having more of a, an opinion about it obviously and um, you know so I just made sure that it was kind of a slow transition so but that's when I first made the sorry I'm eating M&Ms that's when I first made the decision so this October so, yay! Thanks, guys! Dory guy, how's it going? So many people love fall, and I'm also one of those people who loves fall, but summer will always be my favorite because I love hot. So, <laughs> I don't know. 
I feel like I'm such a kid at heart too. Like I just love everything associated with summer, like pools and swimming and the beach and the hot tub and any kind of water, clearly. Slip and slide, my jam, sprinkler, um, ice cream truck, hot, I love it, all of it. Cookouts, you know. Um, I feel like I kind of miss summer this year. Like, I was talking to my family about this and we all kind of agreed. We we're like, I feel like I missed summer because summer is like, I don't, I want to, it's definitely mine and my mom's favorite. Um, and one of my sisters, it's like one of her favorite too. And she's like, yeah, I, I don't know what happened to it, but it's gone. I mean, it's not gone. It's still here because it's still hot out and everything. And people act like September hits and summer's over, but it does start to transition. Like September's still hot here. Or at least it is in Indiana. It doesn't really start to get cold until October. Cause I always pray that it's going to be hot on my birthday and it never is. So it's like, <laughs> I want it to be hot guys. Give me a summer feeling birthday. So. Yeah, awesome decision, Brie. Fall's your favorite, so you move somewhere where fall doesn't exist. I love fall. I really do. I love the fashion. I love the layering. I crochet, so I love making stuff to wear. I love anything pumpkin. It's one of my favorite flavors. I don't drink coffee, so I don't do like the pumpkin spice latte, but I can feel the vibe. I can get down with like the vibe of like, ooh, pumpkin spice, everything else. I love going to the pumpkin patch, apple orchard. It's just so much fun. Like, I love it. Hay rides, haunted hay rides, let's go. I haven't been on a haunted hay ride in probably like 15 years, like forever. Like too many years, more than I can believe is possible. Um, yeah, it's usually pretty warm here in September and then it gets temperamental after that and it's like, it's like uh, warm, cold, warm, cold, and it's like, okay, I don't know what's going on anymore. Um, oh, so cute. You used to ride the horses in hay rides back home. That's so cute. I love winter as well because I love snow, but we don't really get as much snow these days as we used to like back when I was little it, it felt like it snowed all the time and now it's just like we're lucky if it snows once and stays I don't know global warming it sucks but um because you know I especially noticed because like my bow is obviously like eight hours away from me and he's up north because he's in Canada but he's not like deep into Canada like but it still snows so much more there than it does here and it's really not even that far really Midwest weather really is just insane I don't understand I've heard that New Mexico's weather is like the most temperamental like of everywhere it's like the weirdest <laughs> I've never been to New Mexico so I don't know the so so ship 9 how's it going Thank you so much for the sub hype. Thank you so much. I give you all the boz. I realize I, I like said hi to you instead of saying like, thank you for s subbing my chan. For four months too. Thank you so much. Well, why don't we continue the conversation and get started on the unboxing. This is the weirdest shaped box, by the way. So this is it. This is the uh, Lego Mario starter kit so it includes um just the main it's a very like standard type course but i think it has all types of ground so it has grass um water lava oh girl thank you so much for the bits scott man is lego a carb i i don't i don't think it is but thank you for the bits <laughs> Um, I don't know what the brown is. I don't know if there's any reaction. Obviously, it's like the blocks or brick or whatever. But yeah, look at this. It's like shaped like kind of weirdly triangular. I don't understand this package very well, but um, I was like, how do I open this package like a reg box? Um, but anyway, it has all the different types of ground and then it comes with a start pipe, a goal pull. It's funny to say. Bowser Jr. is in here. Goomba is in here and a question block. So like you can see on the top there it kind of spells out the 
five little guys that are in here. So I got this. I didn't get any of the expansions yet. I wanted to experiment with this and kind of see how I want to display it. I don't think I'll have a good way of displaying it in my apartment currently, but um, my hope is to have a little place to display it in my office later when I get a bigger space. So, um, but you know, I didn't want it to be super tough to find. Obviously this comes with uh, Mario and this is his actual size, so. Yeah, that's his actual size, it says. So anyway, this is the starter course, which is the, the main thing we're gonna be opening. And then this little guy, this is, oh my god, I love how cute he looks. You guys know me. Um, I had to get the Mario uh, kitty suit, so I got the cat suit for Mario. I had my choice of any of them, and I was like, I have to go cat suit, <laughs> so, so um, I love that he meows, and he can, like, climb up walls, obviously, so he has a little bit different functionality, but yeah, this is, um, and there you go, actual size again, so this is, like, one of the little extra suits. Now, the starter course is pretty pricey. It's, like, I want to say like $59.99 or something like that. Like it's it's not cheap, but it's because that's like the only way to get Mario. And he's like a little digital guy. The suits are $10 each. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get my favorite suit and then go from there. So yeah, he can climb walls when he's in the cat suit. So he can climb walls in the cat suit. They all have like different, they all have different like things they can do. Thank you for, um, oh my, maybe not thank you. Um... <laughs> Maybe not, thank you. Um, so anyway, I was like, I'm gonna just get one, because I don't really know that I need all of them, but we'll, we'll, we'll work it, so. Anyway, um, we're gonna just unbox the starter course first, and then after that we're going to um, add little suit. So let me go ahead and... I don't know if I can pull this up on here. They're like digital instructions, and if I have to pull them up on my phone, I will, but I wanted to see if I could pull them up on here to like add um, as like a screen that you guys can see, but maybe not, I'm not sure. So, um, Sean Payton, how's it going? Who do I like best? Cyrus, Digby, or Rover? Uh, I don't know. Those are like three people I really don't care about. Probably Rover, because he's a cat. Okay, battery's not included. All right, well, hopefully I have the right kind of batteries for this. All right, let's go ahead and get this guy open in this weird, like, triangular house style box. Um, so yeah. Ooh, one, two. There's like no good way to open this one. Oh, oh. Wow, lots of little pieces. Welcome to Lego. So this is bag. Oh, Goomba's little fit. Oh, we have to like actually build Goomba. He's not like a pre built dude. Like, we have to put him together. And the pipe. This is Goomba and the pipe in here. Let me see if I can do that a little bit. So, this is Goomba and the pipe. I'm just gonna pull out the contents because that's gonna be the easiest. Oh, Mario's hat! Ooh, Mario's hat. We've got like three different color bricks. I think one. Um... We have Mario's overalls, his pants, his pants in here. Um, you gotta love Mario's pants just in with these random blocks. It's pretty funny. Um, what about Goomba in a shoe? What's up, Odin Spec? Um, Shy Guy for days, you are just in time for pop up Lego hype. I'm just taking everything out of the box first, and then we're gonna get to putting some of it together. Again, I'm not gonna probably put all of it together, but I do, oh yeah, the white is like cloud. How cool. All right, so I don't really understand any of this yet. 
I see all the different pieces, but I don't I don't get the the order. The question block is in here. You see it, you guys? It's a little yellow. There it is. It's, it has a glare because it's in this plastic, but... Oh, super cool. Lego takes a long time to build. I was talking to Odie earlier, and he was like, Haha, you're gonna build- you're gonna build the whole thing in, like, a short amount of time? And I was like, absolutely not. So, so many little tiny- Oh, look! That's Bowser Jr! He's in, like, pieces! The poor boy! Um, Shy Guy for days! Also, apparently my sub-anniversary! Thank you for 37 months! Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Shy Guy for days, for 37 months, over three years, girl. Welcome back to the Ba family. I give you all the Ba's. Win! Okay, anyway. Um, here is the quick start guide. Um, a poor little bat. I know, I feel kind of bad looking at them all in, like, little pieces. I guess, you know, they're, they're like children. You know, they have to be in the womb for a bit and be born later. So. Um, oh, cool. I can just pull these up on my phone, but I'm going to... Oh, Mario looks kind of scary when he's not on. Okay, I need two AA bat- or not AA. I need two AAA batteries. I need to get those out. I didn't realize batteries weren't included, so I didn't get any out beforehand. Um, there we go. Well, you can't see that anyway, but whatever. Um, okay, so Mario's in this box. I'm gonna try and open it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, look at that bit. Mario's big aunt. <laughs> He's kind of scary. Like, he really is. Like, look at this. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, I'm glad that he's kind of scary on his own. So we could really put him in his other suits. <laughs> We could really put him in his other suit. Like, you would think that, like, the the RBF on this would be, like, a, his face. Not just black weirdness. Uh, it makes no sense. Um. Okay, anyway, so. How do I put, are you sure there's no batteries in here? There's no batteries in here. There's like a little Bluetooth thing on the back too. Hold on, let me grab. Let me grab some batteries. Grab some bats. Let me just grab some bats. I guess I need a little screwdriver too. All right, well I have three different brands of battery. I don't know if that's good. Probably not, but whatever. Um, so, it is kind of, it really is. Like, it really is kind of scary looking. This little screwdriver has, like, done wonders for me. And I have no idea where it came from. It came with a piece of furniture. You know what? I think it may have come with... I don't know what this came with. If it came with my chair? It came with something, like, totally weird. And I was like, this is the most useful little screwdriver like, how weird is it that it came with, like, a piece of furniture that I ordered? Like, most of the furniture in my place I put together myself. And it was all, like, it all came with tools. I'm gonna do this. It all came with tools. Oh, that's, like, reverse of what I thought was going to happen. Okay. Mario, I really want you to be alive because you look really scary not alive. Okay, so we're going to put Mario's back back on. Perfect. I don't want to screw it too tightly because I don't want it to be like stripped. Okay, cool. Little box. Keep that little box for if I need to put him away. Um, okay, so I need to start with the box and bag number one. So this is bag number five. I want to put everything that we're not using 
over here in the box. I'm sorry, these are kind of loud when they hit each other. And we're going to try his different suits first. So we're going to try his like reg suit and his cat suit. How is this his... Huh, interesting. Oh, this, what? This has like his buttons in it. All right. Gamer Michael, welcome. Um, <laughs> Ella will need to get a screwdriver for the Lego. Yeah, look at how cute his little hat is. Little hat cuteness. The camera's not wanting to focus. Focus on Mario's hat. Fine, don't focus on it. Mm -hmm. All right, so we have three different blocks. We have, oh my God. Legos being a children's toy. Yeah, right. Oh, these are his ears. Wait, not, that's not his ear. That's his button. He has two buttons and an extra button. And then he has two ears and an extra ear. So he's three ears, really. Um, Okay, so look how scary he is. And then I'll put his ear on. Ooh! And his other ear. I gotta open this package too because his overalls are in a separate package. Um, and I think it's cute you put his like buttons on separately. Okay, so there's his little overall suit button his other big button and his hat which look the top of his head's like little little lego brick all right ready how do i how do i do this I, he's not alive yet did i do it wrong maybe these batteries aren't good no, my batteries! Okay, hold on. I might need to try one of the other batteries in there. Because I don't know which one's good. Because the magic. Oh, batteries. You know. I wish it used a watch battery. Like, that would make more sense, but... I guess not. I guess they'd rather Mario corroded. Um. It's pretty cute though. I love how cute little Mario is. That's like one of the one of the main drawing points for me. And I I'm sure they'll come out with other characters that you can play on the courses with and I, I can't wait for what for if they come out with a Wario really can't wait for it. Okay, maybe that one's no good. Nope. I don't know. Again, I would have totally bought some batteries if I'd realized. Oh! Okay, hold on. Sorry. Is it gonna work? Lego, oh, I turned it off. <laughs> That's why. Lego, ma! Okay, I don't want to turn it on all the way until we know. Apparently the Energizer battery was not good, so. Rip Energizer. Here we go! Lego, what? No, how is this not working? I'm so confused. Go for. Go for. Thank you so much for big 15 month hype. We're trying to get Mario to live. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Go for. Let me give you all the bars. All the bars. Thank you. And then we'll get back to. I need to get this to work. Let me rub. Did I try every combination of these? 
Okay, this is gonna be really dumb if this doesn't work. Hopefully it's just like, it actually is the batteries and it's not like, oh, that's not how this works. <laughs> My god, go for it! Thank you so much! Thank you so much for the gift sub to GamerMichael1996! 250 gift subs? Oh my gosh, thank you so much! I give you all the boz, go for. Thank you so much for your incredible, incredible support! 250! I can't even comprehend. Like, I really can't even comprehend that. That's an insane number of gift subs. So thank you so, so much! Unbelievable. I, I really would like. Why is this not. Do I have to like hold it down? Is that what I'm not doing correctly? Maybe I have to hold it down until he says like. Lego Mario Bros. I want you to live! I don't think I have any more triple A's! Ah! Go for, thank you so, so much. Seriously. I don't even know what to say. Exactly. 250, a true legend. I'm gonna give you all these emotes I have up here. All the emotes. Some are probably gonna get cut off, but... Thank you so much. I know I'm, I've been scammed with this, like... No! Okay, I, I need to find... What, what, what uses AAA batteries? Oh, my remote does. Okay, sweet. <laughs> We're hacking my remote. And if it doesn't work with my remote, then I'm gonna be like, uh, maybe Mario doesn't work? Okay, we're gonna use my remote batteries. Story of my life. <laughs> what the, what? What batteries is this? Okay. All right, no more remote. Rip, rip remote. Lego Mario time. Ah! Okay, well, no Lego Mario time until. Oh, no Lego Mario time until we're ready. So hold on, we gotta get your pants back on now that we have the <laughs> working batteries. All right, so apparently these all these batteries that I have just need to be recycled because they all suck. Um, okay, now we're now I think we're ready. I think we're officially ready for Lego Mario time. Um, here we go. Yay! He's very bright. He's not reading super well on the camera because he's so bright. Let me see if I can get it to focus on him. He has like a light on the bottom, which is his sensor. Ooh! Oh my gosh, hold on. Let me mess with my camera, see if I can get it to pick up what he's doing right now. Because it shows on his belly. Because I might have to turn the brightness down on my camera. He's having a good time, though. I'm telling you guys. Okay. First of all... Let's see if I can get this to... Do that. And then... I turn uh okay see how it's showing um grass because he's standing on a green block and it goes away and then water for a blue block I don't know if he like makes sound I don't know Oh, it did make a sound. Oh! He's like this. <laughs> oh no! Sorry, Mario. 
Oh, he's happy now. Okay, good. I love his little mouth! That's so cute! Yeah, he doesn't mind the water. Um, I'll do it one more time. When it with him a little closer. There's his green. Yeah, so like when you bop him on Oh, we found a coin. And then if he's on it for too long. <laughs> he's so cute. Oh, he's so happy. I love him. All right, there we go. Uh, let's go back to here. Um, I'm going to put on, let's see, put my brightness up a little bit. Okay, let's try his cat suit. So I'm going to turn him off for a minute. He goes to like sleep. And he looks really scary. Um, I wish that they, they needed to have like little see-through like transparent stickers or something so he didn't look terrifying when he's asleep. Um, okay. So I'm supposed to whoop, imprint my thumb. It's kind of cool. Alright, so let's get the cat suit. Oh, cat suit. All right, yay, cat suit, so cute. All right, so we'll put him in a, we'll see if what he does when you like turn him on and then you take him out of the suit. So we're gonna take him out of his suit. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry, he's embarrassed. Oh, and let me get um, the hat out because it has buttons. Mamma Mia! This is a little cat hat. And then I need to put his buttons on. Buttons. This is telling me I need to connect to Bluetooth for some reason. The. I guess I need to connect it to my phone, so hold on. <laughs> yeah, ner ner Mario gets nervous when his pants are taken off, for sure. Alright, so let me get this on my phone. There we go. Um, let's see what it says. Um, Mo335, thank you so much. I am having a nice evening. Thank you. <clears throat> Alright, I guess we could build this little suit. Apparently we have to get the Lego Mario app, so we're going to download it and install. And while we're doing that, I'm going to put together... This is all that was in the... This is all that was in the little um, kit that came with our cat suit. So we'll go ahead and put this together really quickly. Let's see if I can aim that down there. It's not great, but it's something. Um, put that to the side while it's downloading. All right, so let's put these pieces to the side. Okay, so we need this block right here, and we just connect these guys like that. So this is just like a little add-on to um, to what we already have, pretty much. And we can put. Oh, how cute is this? Little flowers. And it can, oh look, it comes with like a little extra flower too. Oh no, 
Here we go. Perfect. Little flowers, so cute. So, um, who? No, this is Mario. This is Mario in his cat suit. So, that's not poo. That is not poo. So yeah, if I change this, that's Mario in his cat suit. So. Yeah. Um. This is still downloading. Dang. Okay. Um. Anyway. So we're gonna get Mario squared away in his cat suit. Let's see what's next for. Because this is all that came with the cat suit. Is this little guy right here? Um. I guess this is an extra. Another extra button. I guess they all come with extra buttons, so that's nice. Uh-oh, I'm I'm dropping frames for some reason. Dropping frames. Let's see. If I if I do that, am I good? I don't know why this is dropping frames suddenly. Is it still draw is it still lagging for you guys? Hmm. I'm trying to close things to get it not to lag anymore. And I don't know what it's doing. It seems like it's getting better now, but I it still is doing it a little bit. I wonder why. Maybe because this is downloading? That's kind of weird. I mean, I guess it would pull from my internet, so... So yeah, we're supposed to build Mario, and then we're supposed to literally download the app, is like the next step. It's like, get the app! So, um, but yeah. I think we're okay now. I think it's because the app was downloading, maybe? I lowered the bitrate just to be safe. Sorry, these screens are so super bright. Okay, now we're going to connect Bluetooth to Lego Mario. Oh! Okay. Well, it's showing me this lovely commercial on here. I guess it was just because the app was downloading? Um, I, I bet that was all it was, because that's kind of weird, but... Alright, let's do that. I'm gonna turn the bitrate back up and see if it's okay, because it should be. How lovely. I, yeah, I bet it was just because that was downloading. Also, Mode, I saw your comment, but it's probably my kitty. Like, I have a kitty. So, I'm sure it was just my kitty. Um, alright. Woo! Lego Mario connected! Lego Mario needs an update? What? Who knew Lego Mario would need an update? It was definitely an alien. Yeah, you're right. It was. I've got all kinds of aliens in my in my space. Oh. 
Even Lego Mario needs an update. Like, what kind of garbage is this? If it lags, it's because of this. I'm sorry. It's because it's updating. I promise it'll go away as soon as it's done. I won't say anything important until then. Welcome to the future. Everything needs an update. It's so true. I know, I'm like, whenever I have kids, I'm opening all of their toys and crap and updating them before Christmas morning. So that way Christmas doesn't turn into like, let's wait for everything to update. What? Sometimes you have to update your lights? That's insane. How is this folded? How am I not doing this right? A little I need like a little um a little baggy where's this song from let me see if it says Super Mario 3d world world 3 that's what this song is um oh you have hue lights it's pretty banging to be able to control my lights from my bed I don't blame you I don't blame you it's still updating um, but yeah. Your updating software needs an update. That's, that's how it feels, Psycho. No, Scottman, your computer just crashed. When you were starting your computer back up, it decided to update and make this startup longer. This. So annoying. Remember when Legos didn't used to need to update? Like, come on now. I think the next thing we're supposed to build is Goomba. Uh, I want to say there's no like super exact way to put this together. Like you can kind of do whatever whatever you want. Um, I'm trying to flip through. They do have like mystery packs that you can get of the enemies, which I think is super cute. Oh sweet, I love a bunch of text um yeah i think that honestly it's just meant for you to put together however the f you want so what you do oh he's a kitty now okay oh dina psycho nacho thank you so much for 120 total gift subs thank you for the five gift subs tonight dang you and go for you guys are Crazy, insane, generous. Thank you so much. Seth 715 Wolf of Storms, Nervy Do, Armand 2017, and Phantom. Welcome back to the Ba family, courtesy of Psycho Nacho Man. I'm giving you all the Ba's and popcorn, because it's hacking. The popcorn hacked. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much, Psycho. You are so awesome. And with that, I'm gonna aim this back down here because check out my chai tea, by the way, that I made. I made my own this time, yay. Okay, new power-up pack. Let's go. How do I do this? Okay, let's go. So I think, I don't know what this is doing. I also don't think you guys can see this. There we go. See that? That's what it's doing. So. Um. So, I can climb. What? Oh my gosh, my hand red is fire! Oh, he burns on my hand! Poor guy! He's showing the water. I'm trying to get him to meow. It's so cute when he meows. I love, I love it. Oh, he's so cute when he meows. Oh my god, he keeps catching on fire by my hands. 
I'm sorry, Mario. I'm really not- I'm not trying to do this. Okay, so... Lego Mario... And then... Testing... Okay. So two. Our, so we have missions. So here we go. So our first mission is to create Lego Mario. And our second mission is to defeat Goomba. So we have to put Goomba together. And then we have to build our first course. Um, and it's a very, very short little ditty. So I think what we're going to do is build Goomba next. And I'm going to turn Mario off for this only because I don't want these batteries to die and you guys not to be able to see this. So, um, Goomba's in number two. This has all the little starter stuff doing right now. Alright, this has all the little starter stuff for building Goom. Did this just, like, crash? What in the world happened? Okay, hold on. Alright. I'm gonna move, I'm gonna move this bag over here out of the way. And I'm gonna just put his suit and stuff back here. Extra pieces over here. Okay, now we're arranged. So. Okay. Let's go. I wanna defeat Goomba. Ah! Okay. So here we have the little start pipe. Here's the... Oh my god, stop doing this! Okay. It's gonna show us how to build Goomba, but I'm just gonna get all the pieces out first. So most of Goomba is in here. Because there's his face, just chilling on that block. I love this song. So, so cute. Okay, so it looks like we need... This? Is this what I need? This is not what I need. I need these shoes. These little shoes. Little bits. Um, and I need to put like that. Let me see if I can not only aim this downward a little bit more, but also zoom it in maybe. Not wanting to stay. Come on, camera, you gotta stay. As it slowly moves. Okay, well. Maybe. Okay, that's better. Alright, so here we go. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm just trying to be cinematic, you're right. Okay, so I don't really know why these are split up. All right. Try and build more towards the center. Here we go. There's little Goomba's feet. He's basically a gray block. That's his soul. That's his soul, you guys. Um, and then next comes his face. I need his little... Whoop. Can't put his face on backwards. Here we go. There's his face. He's just a little goom. And then next... I need two little guys. Oh my god, these pieces are all so tiny. I don't want to lose any of them. But I need two little guys for the bottom. Ugh. There we go. He has like two little sides. And then he has these little top pieces that round him out. 
They're not really top pieces, but they go over top of that to make it flush. Flush. Okay, anyway. So. So get hype. Hype. He's so cute! Okay. And then we need his little back piece. So he has a little butt. And then we need his top piece, which is a little scanner. This goes in the corner by his face. So now he has a little scanner. And that's our Goomba. It's not wanting to focus. Can I get a focus? Yeah. Let's check that out. Okay. Hello. This is not wanting to do this. Okay, thank you. Um. Would I be hyped if they made it? I, I wouldn't, actually, because I'm not a big Super Smash person, so I really... I'd rather they just made another Mario Party, to be honest. Um, okay, so Goomba's done. Um, I guess I should put that we made Mario. Um, okay, done. I have to, like, check off everything that's done on this. And now we have to have Mario defeat Goomba. So we're going to turn Mario back on. Ah. And let me hold him up where you can see him. Okay. Yay! He defeated Big Goom! And he gets a coin for defeating him too. So yay, we defeated Goom! I'm trying to watch these, like, little videos, so it's like, oh my god, you watched it! Okay. Oh yeah, if you make him go, like, up high, he makes, like, the jump noise. How cute is that? Okay, so now we need to build the little, um... little pipe so so we can get hype sims 3 fan how's it going hey gowitch how's it going um okay i need oh i did it wrong all right hold on that's not what i was supposed to do i was supposed to make two little waters Look at how nicely that green, like, reads on there, though. Okay, and then these two little guys. Uh, and then this guy. Man, you guys, I want a pumpkin pie. I know that's random, but I just thought about it, and it's like, ugh, I want all the pumpkin stuff. Okay, so... Now we put the pipe on. And now we're good. Alright, so we're gonna do that. Then we're gonna make the flagpole. So there's our pipe, it has a little scanner on the inside. We're gonna take our second little green piece. On one side we put the brown, and on the other side we put the scanner. And it has Bowser's little face on it. You can't see it because it's too blurry, but. That's what's on there. I do like how simple this is. Like, it's very, very simple to to understand, basically. So I'll see if I can focus this so you can actually see it. See the little Bowser on there? Very, very cute, so. Um, and there's, of course, Kitty's fur on it, too. Ignore that. Okay. Now we have the pole. We can just, uh, slide it on in. Alright. Cute. 
little ball goes on here. And then that goes at the top. Okay. And then we gotta clip the little Bowser, little Bowser flag on there. So that it will no longer be a Bowser flag when, um, when Mario steps on it. Yay! And our flagpole's done. And now the next thing we need to do is make little flowers. Again, all these pieces are just meant to be interchangeable so that you can make your own course. So that's why it's kind of like, make all these pieces separately instead of, um, you know, giving you a bunch to do right off the bat. Let's put these two little greens to the side here. And we have our little flowers. One of each color just goes down in there. And we get little extras too. So we have extra flowers to put wherever we like. I like how they give you little extra pieces too. That's always nice. Okay. And then once we have all those made, we're ready to put these guys. So I guess what we could do is this, have like a little green path that leads from our starting point to um, the end. So check that out, and we gotta put Goomba on there somewhere in the in the middle here. Yay! Okay, I can aim this up a little bit. Sorry, my keyboard thing is like getting in the way. All right, cool. Great. I think I got all the pieces out for that. And then we gotta have Mario come out of the pipe, get Goomba. Okay, so we're ready. So Mario's in his cat suit. He's gonna come out. Uh oh. He's coming out. He squished Goomba. And he made it to the flagpole. Yay! He wins! And he got a whopping one, one coin, you guys. He got a whole great big ol' one. What is this doing? Okay. Oh, I have to connect Mario for this to work. Okay, come on. Talentless hack, how's it going? Okay, come on now, you should be connected. Okay. I'm waiting for this to start over because it's like not doing it right now. Here we go. Now it's now it's reading it on my phone, whatever it's supposed to do. I'm gonna see if I can just find random stuff. Look, he's finding coins! He's finding coins! And he squish Goomba. Finished. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to get I'm trying to get like the little goal on here. Oh my god! I don't think that's what he said. But... Yay! So yeah, this just has like a little step by step and you unlock different pieces. Like it's pretty cool. It just has it where you like unlock all the little different pieces to build as you go so that you can make courses more and more ridiculous as you move on. 
So that's pretty cool. So let's try, um, let's try doing one with, um, I have, like all these pieces over here. These pants we're in. I don't want to mess with a lot of them, but I do want to try, um, maybe, um, doing like a green and s or a blue instead of the green. I just won't connect all of these for the moment. Pretend like that's connected, guys. Pretend like that's connected. And we'll put Goomba in the water. Goombas can totally swim. Don't lie. Um. <laughs> okay. So come out of the pipe. And then water. Where's the red? I'm just gonna attack like a million Goombas and see what happens. And then we can, of course, grab the flagpole, you guys, by the way. Swing around. Boom. How many coins did we get? Woo! Seven coins, baby! Yeah, I just spammed Goomba. Alright, cool. So, I think it's pretty awesome that- whoa, that's like zoomed in, sorry, I forgot. Okay. I think it's really awesome that this almost has like a game that you follow. I wasn't expecting this, um, but it really does have like a little game that you follow on your phone as you build. Um, so, let me show you guys. Like, here is... it focuses on it. I might have to make it manually focus on it. So, this is everything we just did. And then if you scroll down, it has all the new pieces coming up that we can make. And so I think like the last thing you come to is a course with Bowser Jr until we unlock more, obviously. So you like slowly put together all of the pieces of the starter course um, to create a whole little level for yourself, which is super duper cute. I wanna see, what all do we have here? Yeah, like we have so many pieces to work with, um, which is so cool. What I really want to do, you guys, because I want to put, like, a course all together. And this is kind of my plan, um, since, obviously, this isn't, like, the greatest quality for this. Um, but what I really want to do is I want to piece a course together for you guys and then make a little video of it once it's all complete, once I've gone through and kind of made each piece, like, step by step. Um, and then probably show that off afterward so that way it's like cool look at this little like little world we've created but I absolutely love the little pieces they're just so cute like I mean Mario's a little terrifying when he's not alive but like I kind of wish that they really did do like a see-through mesh thing or something but you can see how cute this is I'm gonna put this back the way it was with just our little um you know, our little green pieces. Um, so that way I know that this is where I have stopped. I am actually going to just call it right here because I don't want to get too far gone. Um, Cause I really just wanted to unbox and show off the general like idea of the Super Lego Mario. And then I can obviously film a video in better quality and show off my first course and I can also I have the ability to show off video on my streams too so that could be something I like play um, before 
before a stream once it's all put together because this is obviously meant to be a game and take some time so I don't want to rush through it and be like oh I, you know here it all is and it's all out but it's not like it doesn't look cool because it's not like on a space where that's um, a possibility so but I, I think this is so cute I love that it's a game within itself I wasn't like I said I was not expecting that so but like I said, you guys, this was just meant to be like a little short and sweet unboxing stream. Um, not meant to be anything crazy. Oh my god, I didn't even show off the back of this suit. Let me get this close up. Okay, so back of the suit has a little tail and stripes. Girl, with that miss bits! Um... I think that was psycho! Thank you so much for the bits! But isn't that adorable? I love that it has like the little details. This is super cute, you guys. I'm I'm really actually like super impressed by what they've decided to do. And how it's very much like a hey, you use your imagination to make a course. We're not gonna tell you what course to make. Now certainly you can look at the the photo on the box or in the manual. Because, like, here's a photo of in the manual. And get an idea of something you can set up. But, um, and this is with, like, all the expansions. So you can really make, like, a whole little world. But, like, you just set it up, um, however you want it. There's really no structure. Like, for example, you could make this exact structure right here. Once you have all the pieces out. But you can really put it together however you want. There's no, like right or wrong way to do it which I think is fantastic especially for children because I was that kid who always wanted to do things like my own way using my imagination I hate when things are like spelled out for kids um but yeah whoa can't have a short and sweet stream without cake sorry I just now saw this message but yeah I would highly recommend this you guys if you're a lego fan or if you because it really is a game too and I wish I had a way to like pull it up on here rather than just being like an app on my phone. Um, so there might be a way to do that. But I think what I'm gonna do is, yeah, put a course together and then show it off for you guys in a video or something, cause that would be super duper cute and easy to do. Um, the starter course, it it's pretty pricey because it has, Mar that's how you get Mario. I think that's the only way you can get Mario. And it has obviously all the starting pieces to connect everything else. So it's like $59.99. It's like a $60 per, it's like purchasing a Switch game. It's the same difference. It's essentially a game. Um, so I think it's pretty, uh, pretty understandable now that I realize it's like a game because at first I thought wow all the little pieces are that much but it's like meant to be a, its own game so like um you know you figure that's pretty standard f for today so $60 for that each suit is $10 I just got the one I just got the cat suit because it's my favorite because I love kitties you guys know this um and then they also have expansions and all of those are priced differently I saw them in Target um, I didn't get any of the expansions because I figured I would just see how the starter course was and what I could set up with it and go from there. I really want to get the one with Mario's house that comes with Yoshi, though. Um, it's one of the smaller sets, but it's super cute. The toad houses are super fun, too. Um, but yeah, it's really, really cute, you guys. I've, I'm actually more impressed with it than I thought I would be, so... Um, but that is going to do it, baby! Um, let me go ahead and pull up our credit sequence really quickly. And I'm just going to switch over to this for now. Because this is a better screen to launch it on. So, let's go ahead and credit everybody who was here and was super sweet and generous tonight. So, yeah, girl, let's get these credits rolling. Um, so thank you guys for coming out to this super short and sweet bonus stream. Scottman895, Psycho, thank you so much for the bits. To my mods, Bree and Odie who are here. To, well, maybe not to my new follower, but to my new subs and resubs. Stardev, Marching Band, So So Shift, Shy Guy Go For, 
Gamer Michael, Sess, Wolf of Storms, Nerby Doo, Phantom Tempest, and Armand. Thank you so much, and huge shout out to Psycho Nacho Man for the five gift subs, as well as Go For Alex for the gift sub, and 250 gift subs total. Unbelievable. Thank you so, so much for your support. You are so awesome. You guys are the best. So thank you so, so much. Um, I hope you enjoyed this little stream, this little bonus, and um, yeah, that's really all I have to say. Let's see if we can raid somebody. And we had a raid message earlier um, that was actually really funny, and it was... What was it? I can't even remember what it was now. That's a problem. Let me see who's dead. There are a lot of people live on Monday nights, though. I know a lot of people stream on Monday nights, so we should be able to find somebody, no problem. Uh, what was it? Tonight! That's what it was. Tonight! Because everybody posted tonight? Like, literally everybody posted tonight. Um, Slim Kirby's playing Pikmin 2. Let me see what he's doing exactly. Um... Pikmin 2 Session 3. English action. Sorry, I'm watching an ad. Super fun. Tonight? Yeah, I said I was streaming tonight and everybody was like, at like literally 10 people in a row posted tonight. I think a lot of them did just for the meme, but. Um, oh, good night, Brie. Good night, everybody. I love you guys so much. It's been such a fun little ditty little bonus i'll be back tomorrow though i will be live tomorrow at 1 p.m with animal crossing followed by harvest moon so it's gonna be a chill day um it's gonna be pretty fierce and fabulous so let's go ahead and raid slim so oh oh that was weird it like didn't load right away all right guys love you all i will see you tomorrow stay fierce and fabulous have a wonderful night and god bless bye